guys, it's Wisteria, and welcome back to another episode of Animal Crossing New Leaf. So, it does look like we've had some mail. I've actually forgotten to check the mail. Oh, something I should point out. I planted our perfect apple tree. It is going here because I have a lot of places where I want perfect fruit trees to go, so... I decided to go ahead and plant this one. I'm glad to see it's growing. I was scared that it wasn't going to, but oh, our inventory is very full of presents. Hold on. Should probably fix that. I've done a little bit more work on the paths. Not anything too grand, but a little bit. Oh, we have a letter from our mom. Ooh, what does this say? Darling Wisteria, remember how much you loved the stew I'd make in the winter. Maybe you can try making it yourself now. Don't burn yourself, Mom. I actually am not a big fan of stew, but thank you, Mother. Uh, let's open that up, see what that is. Ooh, piece of furniture, space heater, all right. <laughs> okay, so I need to get more inventory room up here. I just kind of shoved some of my stuff up here. I need to buy something that I can store stuff in. I don't think I have anything yet. But we can probably get one soon. Let's go ahead and get our other two letters. I wonder what they are. We have one from Red's Gallery. Oh, so it's that painting. And then from Fuchsia. Oh, I think I went over to Fuchsia's house. Okay. So we do need to go to retail today. I try to refrain too much from selling things. I do a little bit, like in between episodes. But I try not to do anything too drastic money-wise or anything else except for the paths, pretty much. To Cool Kid Wisteria, thanks for coming over to my place. You know I don't care what others think, but hearing you compliment my place was awesome. Here's my thank you gift. See ya, Fuchsia. Ooh, okay, so she gave us a present. Let's open it up. A scenic painting. No, that's what Red gave us. Let's open this one up. An editor's desk. Okay. I don't think that can store stuff. Oh, also, we need to take this guy to blathers and also some fossils. We have a lot of stuff that needs to be dug up because honestly I haven't had the inventory room <laughs> to dig everything up but as you can now see I have added more flowers and bush place markers around so I know where I'm gonna put all of those. I'm so excited for this like I know it looks really weird and horrible right now like the way that I have all the placeholders out but soon it'll look great I promise like Maybe not soon, but eventually it'll look great. Oh, there's a weed. No. Oh, no. No. Oh, the struggle. Okay. Okay. I accidentally erased some flowers, but it's okay. I'm sure I'll remember that it goes there. We do need to talk to Isabel also and go to the stores. And we're going to go to Windhelm today. And maybe even move in a new villager because I do have amiibo cards. I'm not sure who I'd want to move in. Like, Fuchsia was one of them that I was wanting to move in, but she moved in on her own, so don't really need to. We can store things in this. Ooh, can we store things in this? This would kind of, like, it, it's kind of giving me the space vibes. I don't know. Uh, I kind of want to buy this. How much is this? Uh, that's not bad. We need to sell stuff first, though, so we actually have inventory room, but I think I'm going to get that, and I'll get the clothes closet just in case. It's good to have things filled in in your catalog anyways. We're making pretty good money, so we could probably try to buy more things from the stores, even if we don't need them particularly. Oh, we don't want to sell that. We'll sell that. And that. I don't think we need that. I don't remember what it looks like for sure, but I want inventory room so bad. Okay, see, that's pretty good, so we'll take that and then buy this, and we'll also get this. So there we go. We still need to pay off our house. Maybe we can work on that in the next episode. We have so much planned for this episode that I, I don't think we could. I'm not for sure, but we'll see what happens. I'm sorry, once again, if the loading screens don't look as good. That's because I'm filming during the daytime. It usually looks better if it's nighttime. I don't have the extra light coming in the window and soiling everything, but I'm kind of going on a recording spree today, so I wanted to go ahead and get this done too. Let's go ahead, go up here. Oh look, our new brick is down. Doesn't that look pretty? I like it a lot. So nice. Okay, so we're like gonna have no <laughs> room in here. Uh, I really like this tree. I don't want to take it down, but like it's not Christmas, but... Uh, we're gonna take it down. 
we might put it back up later because I really like that tree, but we don't really have room, sadly. Uh, I don't know if we can store things in this or not. Let's see. Doesn't look like it. Ah, dang it. I was hoping we could. Okay, so maybe we can put the chicken up. I really like the lily pad table. I don't really want to put it up. So we can go ahead and put the other thing down. Uh, I keep clicking on the wrong thing. Ah, there we go. Okay, so let's put some extra stuff up in here. I actually... Okay, so we'll put that there. We'll keep the rooster because he's kind of cool. And then I need to clean out my presents, but we'll do that later. Oh, actually, we need to put our clothes in there. I changed clothes while I was working on the paths last night because I didn't have enough room in my inventory for them, so... Yeah, we'll put our nice dress back on. I don't think you guys really got to see it in its full color last episode, so here you go. It's very nice. Let me show it off a little bit more. Isn't it cute? It's so adorable. I love it. Okay. I don't know if I want to change my character's hair color. I quite like it whenever it's in these braids and it's pink. It's a little bit darker. Like, I'm trying to not go for too many pastels in this series just because I have so many in Windhelm. Like, don't get me wrong, I love pastels. Like, I think I have, like, two sides to my personality and one of them loves pink and floral things a lot and then the other loves, like, galaxy and, like, LED lights and purple and blue and, I don't know, things like that. It's hard to balance the two. Like, I'm always struggling with which ones I like more because I can never decide. Let's go ahead and go in here as well, see if there's anything to help us with our blue palace. Let's see, not seeing anything so far. What about back here? Nope, I don't remember what roofing I wanted to get. Hold on, hold on. I think, honestly, the roofing we have right now might be what I was wanting to get because I found a picture that I really liked of how I want my house to look and I think that it has the same roofing we have now. I just can't tell because mine's covered in snow. Okay, so let's see what the tiny nooks have today. We're just going to go to all the stores, I think. Oh my gosh, <gasps> a lovely chair. Yes, okay. Mm. I know I said I wasn't going to go for too many pastel things, but you know, red's not really that pastel. We might want this later on, so we're going to buy it just so that it will be in our catalog. And also, the more things you buy from them, the quicker they'll get an upgrade, which means they'll have more furniture, which means they might actually have something good. Eventually, hopefully, at least, they'll have something good. Oh, we also should have a house in our showcase. I need to remember to do that. We have so much to do today, as always. Like... I want to like shorten these episodes down a little bit, but I never can because <laughs> there's just too much to be done. Okay, so I do want to go ahead and buy this sapling because I killed so many trees, you guys. Like, there's still probably more that I'm going to have to chop down. I'm going to go ahead and give my axe back to my other mare because we can buy axes. I got the most of the tree chopping done. I just wanted to have the golden axe for the... One day that I was spending a lot of time working on my town, but now it's just kind of like a casual, I'll get a little bit done each night type of thing. Okay, so let's see what we have here today. Um, nothing too interesting, to be honest. Let's go over here. Okay, uh, once again, nothing too interesting. I know I need to be spending money at the shops so that they'll get upgrades, but I also don't like buying things that I don't think I'll ever want. Like I do later on, like whenever I have nothing else to buy, like in Windhelm I do, if I see something that's not in my catalog, I'll buy it, but usually I don't like to very much when I'm just starting out, you know? Okay, so let's go ahead and speak with Blathers. We have a few things that need to be donated. Hopefully this painting is real. That's what I want to know first. Like I know we could probably donate them all at once, yeah we can, but I really want to know if this painting's real. I know he'd probably tell us either way. Don't judge me. I just want to hear what he has to say about it. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, good. It was real. All right. So let's have him assess these fossils. We'll probably have to come back to him later. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. Like, I'm sure we'll find plenty more fossils later on, but... We'll just go ahead and donate these for the inventory room. Oh, 
Ooh, none of them we have already. Okay, okay. Okay, so now we'll donate all of them. We have so much today, wow. So I'm kind of thinking about bringing back my Happy Home Designer series. I know I kind of let it like just fade away because I think it's a thing that you kind of need both screens for. But now that I am able to record both screens, would you guys like me to do more Happy Home Designer? I don't think it'd be a weekly thing because I have too many series going on right now, to be honest, but I might bring it back. Like, maybe every couple of weeks I'll do an episode or something. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Okay, so let's go to the showcase. I bet it's just my mare. But if we talk to him, then eventually we'll start getting, like, balloons and stuff from him. So it's okay if I just street pass myself. It's not as exciting that way, but it'll be fine. Yep, it's just myself. Oh, look at his scary eyes. Okay. Oh no, please. Oh no, don't talk. No, no. I don't want to listen. Ah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so, oh, he already has a balloon for us. How nice. Oh, look, it's me. So this is what I look like when people street pass me. Wow, weird. Oh, I forgot my little saying was Fusor Da. I mean, it makes sense. Look at me. There's me. Oh, look at all my badges. I've never got to show you guys my badges. Boom. Don't have all of them yet, but getting close so that's cool okay so give me that balloon we're not gonna look at my own house if you want to see my house i have a town tour that shows that but look we have a cute little balloon now ah it matches our outfit ah how perfect okay we're just gonna take our leave then it makes me sad that not as many people carry their 3ds's with them like whenever i was in high school around like i think like 2013 and 2014 a little bit of 2015 i feel like it started dying down a bit then like, people always had their 3DSs with them, and I street passed so many people with Animal Crossing, and it was great. Never figured out who they were, because- Or, like, I knew how s who some of them were, but not everybody. I wish I did, because I'm sure we would have been friends. The only way I ever made friends in school, basically, was through <laughs> a common interest in a video game. Also, I was going to talk to you guys. Do you think that, like, this path, like, this galaxy one that I'm standing on right now, do you think I should just keep this one? Because I had another one in mind, but I put it down, like, one of the paths, like, just the basic stone one like this, and it looked really busy and kind of bad. So, I think I might actually just leave it as this one, because this one's grown on me a lot. Like, I think I love it. <laughs> I don't like that it doesn't have the border, like, along the edges here, but it'll be, like, the whole town's gonna be covered in flowers, like around the paths and whatnot, so I, I think it's fine if we just leave it like that. I should probably remember to dig things up now that I can, shouldn't I? There we go, it's a fossil. Ooh, this little thing's going off, hello. Let's go ahead and receive the coupons, don't know what we did, but that's nice, I guess. Oh, I don't think Isabel was particularly wanting to talk to us, I was wanting to talk to Isabel so that we can start a public works project if she has one that I'm interested in. Okay, so let's run around and talk to her about that. Public works projects. We'll do ordinances eventually because I don't think I want to turn on the beautiful town ordinance right away because I need to try and get some black roses. I don't think I have any in Windhelm to give myself, so I'll probably have to grow those on my own. But I kind of want to get some black roses so that I can get gold roses. Because I think that would look nice to have around. Okay. So let's see what we have on our list right now. Okay. So what do we have? I don't really want the reset center because I don't like Rossetti. We can build another bridge. That could be nice. We'll probably do that eventually for sure. Ooh, we could put our fountain down. Uh... There's also, like, a bunch of things. I want to have some of these around, like, at least two. Uh, I think we're gonna put our fountain down. Like, why not? <laughs> we're gonna have a hard time making our town a perfect town, because apparently the illuminated stuff actually goes against making your town a perfect town because of the light or something. Like, the villagers don't like the light, but we're gonna have illuminated stuff everywhere. So that's gonna be a little bit difficult. I mean, I guess it's no big deal if we don't get the golden watering can, but, like, it'd be nice. 
Okay, so the fountain I was wanting to have in front of my house because I need a fancy and grand entrance, okay? So I was wanting it to be about right here. Let's see if we can get it in the right spot. I don't quite remember how to get it in the right spot. I know that you can stand in a certain spot and it will be, but we'll see what it looks like here. Let's see here. Nope, that is not quite right. Okay, so I need to stand... Uh, I, I think I know where now. Okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. Let's go over here. I think we need to stand here and then it'll be in the right spot. Let's see, what will it look like here? Yes, perfect. Oh, look at it. Okay. Yep, that is the spot. Look at that. Making progress. Oh, yay. We have Lloyd now. He's so cute. All right. Okay, so I don't think we're going to have time today to move in a villager. I don't think I really want to talk to Wisp because we still need to go to Windhelm. All right, so I'm going to dig this up. Or do I have inventory room? You know, we're just gonna leave it for now. I'll mess with it after the recording. Like, I'll go through and dig everything up because, let's be real, that's not very interesting, is it? Like, it's gonna be a gyroid or a fossil, like, pretty much. <laughs> so, I need to actually bring up my other 3DS. Was there anything else I was wanting to do while I was here? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, um, real quick, before we go to Windhelm, over here, I had asked you guys what I should do with the strip of land, and you guys gave me a few ideas, and all of them I'm going to try to combine together. So the suggestions were to have it like a wilderness area, to have it be like a exotic or like non-native fruit tree area, and to have like a nice little bench and illuminated heart. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to have a sign right here that's going to be pointing like this way and have like maybe a bowl of fruit or something and then you can see where I've marked where I want the trees to go and I also am going to have like a water path going through here to kind of keep the villagers from moving. Also if you see these moon paths around that's just to mark where villagers can't move into like it's kind of to keep them from moving into certain places. I've put them all over town or at least I've been working on it. It's not complete yet but yeah there's gonna be some trees here. We have this annoying rock and then right here if it will go I hope it'll go here. I want to have the bench if not we could have it back one and this back one too but there'll be an illuminated heart right here so it'll be really cute to sit here and take some screenshots. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead, boot up Windhelm, and we're gonna go over there. I'm so glad I have two 3DSs now. I have three, technically. I don't use the other one. I'm actually thinking about doing a giveaway if I could just figure out how shipping works. <laughs> well, I don't know. We'll see about that. And also, I can probably use Mayor Jake to help me get the train station renovation, but I don't know if I want to do the fairy tale one or the modern one. Like, Neither of them fit in perfectly. I feel like the modern one might a little bit more, but I like the fairy tale one better. But I have the fairy tale ones in Windhelm, so I might just go with the modern one just to be different from Windhelm. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about that. Okay, so I have that opening up right now, so let's go ahead and run to our train station. Oh, there goes the town tune. Isn't it cute? so cute. It's kind of slow, but yeah, I like it. I like the Sailor Moon one. I haven't changed the one in Windhelm yet. Still need to do that. It's nighttime right now in Windhelm because I did the thing again last night where I set the time to be earlier in the day so that I could play, you know, if that makes sense. But yeah, let's go ahead, visit another town. I have talked to Porter before because I went and got punchy and we are going to go to a nearby town because my 3DS is right beside it or they're both right beside each other. Okay, and we're gonna pick up some roses. Oh, also, I have a bunch of gems that I need to bring over here, but I think I might wait on that because I don't have much storage and I don't wanna put the gems down just yet because I wanna be able to at least try to get a perfect town before we do that. I don't know if we can, but we can try. Okay, so we're gonna be on our way. I'm excited you guys haven't got to see. I mean, you've probably played this game before, I don't know. But if you haven't, here you go. This is I'm hitting my charms on my other 3DS, but this is what it looks like when you go to another town. Isn't it cute? It's cute. So there we go. We're just not even going to sit down. We're just going to stare out the doors. 
<laughs> I always thought that was a little strange, but whatever. And here we are in Windhelm. Oh yay! I need to make the flag have like flowers on it. I've been meaning to do that too. Right now it's just pastel, but it's, it's still cute. It's still cute. Okay, so here we are. There is Mayor Jake. It is really dark right now, but we're gonna run over here to where I keep my extra flowers. We'll go ahead and take a couple of blue ones and a couple of purple ones. You can't really tell the difference when it's nighttime, but I swear these over here are purple. These over here are blue. Do I want pink ones? I don't know. If I ever want pink ones, we can come back for them. But yeah, I think that's all I was wanting to get. Oh, we should go ahead and just get cherries while we're here. I mean, I have all the fruit here. Uh, I could probably do that, actually. I should go ahead and get some fruit. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that. Because it takes forever to get the fruit if you don't, like, get them from somebody else. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and get some of these. So we're not going to have inventory room for all of them, so I'll have to come back unless... I can put one thing up. There we go. Okay. Because I really need to plant some new trees because I killed so many and I kind of feel bad about it. But I think that's good enough for now. I mean, I know we still have one spot, but we should probably just go ahead and go back. Oh look, there's Fuchsia again. Weird, we have her in both towns. What does she say if we have her in both towns? Does she acknowledge that? Nope, <laughs> she doesn't. That's so strange. Hmm. Okay, so let's just go ahead and head back to Solitude. Okay, so now we are back in Solitude. I'm probably just going to plant the roses, water them, and then... I call it an episode. I feel like it's getting a little lengthy. I have quite a lot to record today. So what I'm gonna do is the same thing that I do in Windhelm and plant the roses on the beach because here villagers can't murder them, which is always nice. So here we will plant the blue roses. There we go. Very lovely. Ah, oh, they're gonna look so good with that path. Oh my gosh. Okay. And then here, we will plant the purple. Oh, I'm so excited. My webcam still doesn't like picking up the purple very much. Like, don't they look the same? I'll need to work on tweaking that so that you can actually tell the difference. I promise they look different. Okay, and then let's water these real quick. Uh, we're gonna have to water them one by one. Not used to that at all. <laughs> used to having the golden watering can, but that's okay. And then hopefully these will grow, we can grow our rose farm bigger, and then we can start putting them around the town. But yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave it here. Don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!